Uh, hello, welcome back to another Bob's Burgers reaction. We're on season one, episode twelve, Stand by Gene. Okay, I'm very curious for this episode because obviously it's a Gene focused episode, but besides that, they didn't really give much, so I don't exactly know what to even predict. I feel like out of all the Belcher children, Gene gets like the least episodes focused on him because I don't know he seems to just go along with either what Louise or Tina does. Well, I mean, he goes along with Louise more often than than Tina, though, to be honest, but... But yeah, since I've got practically nothing to predict, let's just get into it. Ugh, I'm bored. Somebody <laughs> do something interesting. Well, wait till you see our new handshake. Okay, I'm very... I want to see yet. Oh, it is amazing. Uh, it is pretty slow today. You guys want to take the day off, maybe? Oh, Can shit. Yeah, today I'm already fucking leaving. Uh, I just said it. Be back in time to help clean up after closing. Okay. If would move a little faster, we wouldn't have heard that. But did. <laughs> now you gotta have yep. help. Hey, what's up? Wait, what the hell? I told the kids not to store the napkins under the sink. They're all oh. ruined. On the plus side, you made three in a row. Yeah, that's honestly quite impressive. Found another quarter! Two Fuck me, how Two often did people lose their money here? The I mean, to be fair though, isn't this underneath? No way. Like the amusement park a bit. Two goat impossible. I swear what? I saw it. Two butts. On a okay. Right past that coin. <laughs> what? Is this... Is G gonna try and find his fucking goats now? Two Watch this one, Lynn. Off the counter and swish. Well, Jesus Christ. Why is he? Why is he so good at this? Oh All shit! Right. Now I have to make the same shot. And oh I my miss. God, he missed uh, for right, the so first I time. Get an H. Yeah, you do. Which is good and fine, and this is fun. <laughs> oh yeah, okay, okay, okay never mind. He's definitely getting competitive. What the fuck? Okay, I guess they're both good at this apparently. Sportsmanship. <laughs> yes. You're seriously telling me you don't want to Candy go and can do. Okay. Goat. That cornfield on Route Six is really far away. Also, there's no such thing as a two-butted goat. I mean, they I guess they technically could be a. You know, if it like it's mutated or some shit. I don't know. If you know what I mean, or like a birth defect. What's going on here? What are we doing? Well, me and Bob are playing horse. He's about to lose. <laughs> oh, you guys are competing. Uh oh. Well, we'll have to finish later anyway, because uh, I have to go make your food. So. No, no, no. I'll wait. Wait, what? Oh my god. Uh, uh, okay. This will either be fun or terrible. Yeah. Oh rest. my god. Okay. Wow. What's all this? Uh, of course, it's fucking more that comes in this one. I swear to God, 99% of the time, it's only these two in the restaurant. No. What the fuck that guy? That ride, I can't tell if that looks amazing or if that's fucking like, you know, terrifying. Trust me, Gene. When we're flying on this thing inverted, defying the laws of gravity and spitting in the face of science, you'll forget all about the two butter. He definitely won't. Let's be real. Say what? Oh, hey guys. Hi, Jimmy Jr. Zeke and Jocelyn and Tammy. I guess I didn't get the invitation to the eighth. Are you even friends with them? Like they, most of, like Zeke. And Jimmy Jean, to extent, seems like the only one that actually, like, gets along with you. But, like, even, like, Zeke and that doesn't seem to, like, you know, be on full-on friends with you. Hi, guys. Oh, shit. Rudy, what the fuck? Everyone's here, apparently. The whole time. Everyone keeps cutting in front of me. Okay. Yeah, it's too crowded here. Zeke, let's go on that ride over there. Oh, my God. Is Jean going to bring up the two butted goats? Oh, shit. Oh, they right. He heard it. talking about a two-butted goat on a farm out by the cornfield on Route 6. And I'm the only one who wants to go see it. Well, <laughs> count me in, G. Yep, none of you Oh, that can't be real. You think? The cow's got four <laughs> stomachs. Why can't a goat have two butts? Technically, okay. a cow just has one stomach with four separate chambers. But there yeah, I knew something along those lines. So a two-butted Because I remember hearing someone on TikTok or something mentioning that for some reason. Maybe it's my destiny to go on this journey. Whoa, I mean, I guess whoa. so. We can spend our whole day going to look for this thing and it might not even exist. Yeah, that would. Right. I mean, it, it would. Who knows? Maybe the journey there might be fun. So I ask you, would you rather have a lifetime of regret or an afternoon of mild disappointment? <laughs> that is deep. I mean, I guess so. Oh my god, I was just about to say the same thing. I really was. Oh my god. Oh my god. Go. Okay. Go? Should Let's we go? go? Let's, Let's go. go. I am in. <gasps> no, back out. Okay. Jeez. No, back in. Oh. Okay. Fine. I'll go. And when we get there and there's no goat, Jean, you have to do all the cleanup when we get back to the restaurant. I mean, I guess fair enough. Then I'll do all the cleanup. Okay. Either way, I don't have to clean up. <laughs> oh, so yeah. That's actually fucking true, though. So Tina wins either way. So you know, Jean, if we get lost, just 
still have to do all the cleanup. Worth it. Looks like we just stay on this road and it takes us to Route 6. And then there's lots of dotted lines and a yes. big green patch. That must be Iowa. Those dotted <laughs> lines are probably fire roads. And yes. it looks like this one might be a shortcut. If the road's on fire, we're not going on. Oh my god. Oh, that's obviously not what it means. More importantly, are we talking about separate anuses? <gasps> Does that mean it can fart in harmony? Harmony. <laughs> oh, hell yes. I never even thought of that. This is bigger than I imagined. Hell yes. It's the biggest thing ever. And it's not real. Why are you being so negative? They can't. <laughs> I mean, I could understand her not believing it's real. And plus, she was more excited about that fucking ride or whatever. They have, like, its own show on TLC. And that is so true, though. <laughs> fucking TLC has the most the best stupid ass shit mm -hmm. on it. I would agree to disagree because that's actually how I learned that green scrunchies are out. Okay. What? Oh my god, you're being paranoid. I told you that I liked it. I know. Okay, I sure. I it exists. The world is full of mystery and magic. I mean, I don't think it's that fucking out of the ordinary. Like, isn't there like two-headed shit? Like, snakes and shit. You lose a game that you invented. Sometime today, Bob. Damn it! <laughs> I be Bob and okay, yeah, I fucking knew it, of Rematch. course. I'm up. All right, well, uh, maybe we should do a, a tournament. Uh, more probably once okay. in, right? More? No, I don't yeah. think he... Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, Lord, you ruin everything. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> Jesus. I'm sorry. Great, I'll okay. draw it up. Write my name up there as Winda. No. Too bad if people come in and you don't actually want to eat. Too bad it goes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Our voices sound good together. No, they don't. Like hog <laughs> goats. Hey, I think that's the fire road. Yeah. Two, two. Why are you dragging your wagon, Jimmy Jr.? Yeah. Is he fucking jealous of Zeke and Jane getting along? Look at them. Two buddy goats this, and our voices sound good together that, and there's the fire road this. Wait, 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 wait. Are you jealous yes. of Tina? What? what? Why would I be jealous of Mr. Perfect hears about every two buddy <laughs> okay. goat in the world? Oh my god, you're so gene jelly. I mean, yeah, he's about every two buddy go in the world because there's fucking one in the world okay but i mean at least it's admitting it just carefully Ma limbo through the wire yeah you're going to get it yeah oh my god oh. Wow. <laughs> it didn't even hurt hey i'm gonna pass the zap who wants some I i'll take a zap Zeke. <laughs> <laughs> wait what the fuck i didn't realize that you'd be able to do that that's what i'm talking about he gets it oh man electricity was literally running between them <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's actually funny, though. Here's how you go through with the least amount of contact. Oh, and you're still gonna fucking get... I got it. No. Don't your muscles in that tense up when you go in electric fence? All right, door handle. All right. Okay. Okay, Teddy, this is it. Last shot. You have to make this or Linda wins. I got this. He's gonna miss. Yeah, ah, of course. Lot, Fuck me, why? I thought Bob was gonna this shit at the start of the episode, but Linda's, like, obviously better. Okay, Jesus. Hey, calm down, Teddy. Don't do touch okay, me. Jesus. Teddy. <laughs> Don't you see what's happening? What? She started us against each other. You are. Oh my God. All she's doing is fucking weeding. That was pretty lame cornfield scene. No mazes, no scarecrows. No. Well, it, it was obviously just a regular cornfield. And now we get to cross a river on a dead tree, like in the movies. <laughs> that's fun. Oh, I mean, yeah. Wait. Hold on, everyone. I think that's poison ivy. Oh. Uh oh. Great. First Gene's idea gives Zeke a twist he didn't used to have. It'll go, I. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're all gonna be itchy. I say we head back. Yeah, I heard poison ivy is really bad for your skin. I mean, Why? yeah, obviously. No, I already <laughs> have eczema. I don't even want to know what poison ivy will do to it. Okay, listen. If we keep going, it may be a risk. To I mean, that is a lot of fucking poison ivy, though. So, like, I feel like he's gonna be fucked if he's at least attempt if he's attempt to go through that. Oh, who will stand with me? I'm actually no done. Sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. Well. Yeah, we're out, right, Zeke? No way, Jeju. If it's out there, we have to try. I love how he's fucking just so, you know, fucking interested in seeing this stupid two-buttoned goat, if it's even real. Man, that poison ivy is thick. I knew I was going to get a rash today somehow. <laughs> so what do we do now, Gene? Well, I think if we could hop from rock to rock, we could stay above. Ah, uh, that's pretty fucking dangerous, though. Like, if you, you know, miss the rock and land in the poison ivy... The poison ivy, you're pretty fucked. Look. Oh, okay. Well, at least it's well, nearly there. To it without walking through poison ivy. Maybe we could swing across on a vine. Um. No. Yes. Well, Jane, <laughs> we tried your idea, and it was a gigantic failure. So, time to head back. No. Only one of us has to get poison ivy for us all to see the two-butted goat. What okay. do you mean, only one of us? 
one person gets it by carrying the rest of us. I get Jesus oh. Christ. Oh wow. And since this whole thing was my idea, okay, that's actually that a fucking be me. I okay, can't wish shit. Over here. This guy's my that's actually like a fucking pretty major like thing to do because you're like you're gonna be fucked for the next week or whatever. What I miss? It's still nar to nar. She'll slip up soon enough. Mike is our best hope. Flying burgers picture. <clears throat> yes. nice okay. One. <laughs> okay, shit. Return to sender, baby. <laughs> get it? Yes, now. we get it. Oh, fuck me. I mean, I've never been, like, anywhere near Poison Ivan that before. In fact, I don't even know if it's in Australia. But I could only imagine how fucked that would hurt. Like, at least itch. Damn, I thought that was gone. It's all gonna be worth it. We're almost there. Oh my god, please let there be a two-butted goat. Please yeah, there if there's not one goat. after all of this is fucking no, effort, almost the end of I would, it would be I such... Is going to be it would right. actually be a lot there. farmer, please let him be a teen farmer. What, Tina? I said, please let him be a teen farmer. Shut up, a nobody nothing. Well, you don't know yet. Wait, look! <gasps> Show us your butt! How are you even gonna be able to see it? Wouldn't you be able to be close up to it? <laughs> it's, it's the one, buddy. Go. Oh, okay. Well, that's fucked. Especially after all the poison ivy. Okay. I don't believe it. Oh my god. So <laughs> it is. Everything just has one butt. Okay. Also, that's two tails Jean, as well. Look. It's time for me to. Okay, Jane, turn around. Jane, 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 turn around. What? Oh my god, what the fuck? That looks so cursed. I did not like that. Turn <laughs> that game, what oh the? Oh my god, what's wrong with me? Yes. <laughs> There's all the fucking competitiveness. Just good. Where were you? Sorry, Teddy, I can't do it. That's my wife. Yes. And... Oh my god, okay. Linda, yes, great job. Wait, you cheering for me? Yes. Uh-huh. And... Oh, okay. Linda well, free mail. Also, hey, <laughs> people when I was in primary school, people used to fucking wet like toilet paper and that all the time and chuck it on the roofs. And uh, somehow it managed to stay there for like the entire year. In hindsight, one of us should have brought a camera. <laughs> yes. Me too. I could stay here and stare at this beautiful bastard's butt. I did not want to look at that. Stay away from my goat. Get off my land. Yeah, I was going to say. I was gonna say, wouldn't they get? Oh, I'm kidding. Come on, that's just a. Oh, okay. You really did it, Gene. You changed our lives. Yes. Yeah, come here, Gene. Victory wrestle. Come on, come on. No. Ah, uh, yeah. Don't do that in fucking way. There's goat shit around. You guys. I'll wrestle you, Gene. That's right. That's my wrestle rascal. That's my wrestle rascal. Get up here. Come on. I am. Assume the position, big boy. Okay. I can flip you over. Flip you over. Ah, my head. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It was a perfect day, Gene. Yeah, I don't even Honestly, yeah, that was... The fact that there actually was one was fucking insane. You're welcome. Besides, how dirty can the restaurant be? Oh my god, it's gonna be insane after the fucking... Honestly, that was one of the most f entertaining episodes of this show I've ever watched. Holy shit, like, that honestly might be one of my favourite episodes of, like, the show overall. I don't know, I just really enjoyed this one. It was just such a fun, like, adventure or whatever. And the fact that Gene actually carried them through the Poison Ivy is insane. Like, fuck me, I... I mean, I guess, like he said, you know, he was the one that brought them there. But still, that's, that's like, a fucking insane thing to do. But, like, oh, well. I don't know if Poison Ivy isn't even, even in Australia. Because I've never really come across it before. I mean, there's probably some equivalent that I don't know about or something. Who knows? The fact that the two fucking buttered goats actually existed, it's insane. Because it looked... I'm not gonna lie, it looked cursed to me. I ha I did not like it. But what the fuck? Okay, the fact that he just heard, overheard people talking about it's kind of funny. Like underneath the pier and that. Also, where they were underneath the pier, is that when they got tied up? Or well, Bob got tied up and almost died in that one, like a couple seasons ago? But oh my, I don't know. I don't even know what to say. It was interesting seeing Jimmy Jr. get fucking jealous because Gene and Zeke seem to be getting along a lot more. Which. Thinking about it, Zeke and G in some aspects seem kind of similar. So I'm not even that surprised they get along pretty well. Also, I just realized that means that Gene's gonna have, have to carry them back through the fucking poison ivy, which fuck that. Like, I could only imagine how much, like, that itches and shit. Like, again, Poison Ivy, I don't think it's in Australia. I mean, it probably is. It, it could be, but I'm not 100% sure. So I've never really encountered it, but yeah. 
I could only imagine the fucking pain that would be. And oh my god, and there was the B plot as well, which that was fun as well. Seeing Bob and Linda get all competitive over like Chucky. First it was like just tissue, like paper towel napkins or whatever into the bin. Like as a basketball sort of equivalent. And then to doing it with wet napkins, which, oh my god. <laughs> I feel so sorry for the kids having to clean that up. Also, the fact that people actually started to come into the restaurant while they're doing that is kind of funny because Bob would have had to stop and go and make their food, you'd think. Just imagine going to any sort of restaurant and sitting there and the owners are like fucking chucking wet napkins and shit around. I mean, it would be entertaining to watch though, to be fair. <laughs> but I don't know, I found the part where Bob, you know, all of a sudden comes to a realisation, oh shit, this is Linda, why am I doing this? And it's just like, you know... Has like the hearts or whatever around there. I don't know, I found that funny. But when I was in primary school, which is basically just elementary school. I mean, I never really did this. I, I, I actually, actually, I think I might have once. No, but kids used to always in the boys' like toilets, just grab toilet paper, wet it and chuck it on the roof. And I swear to God, if they didn't care enough to clean it, or they just didn't know how to, like, because it was that stuck or something. Oh, I don't know, maybe kids used to just do it so often to the point where... There was just always toilet paper on the roof. But yeah, kids used to wet it in toilet paper and just chuck it on the roof. And would be stuck up there for like, I don't know, ages. But yeah, I mean, I've got nothing else to say, really. That was a really good episode. Like, honestly, one of my favorites. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>